Hello everyone. Oh, uh, yep. 96 Maxima VQ30. This is another update. I finally got that damn timing cover off. Thank God. Um, got the crank bolt out. Uh, used to YouTube for a little uh, assistance on that little bump start uh, to remove the crank bolt. I finally got it off and. Oh, got the timing cover off and giving you guys a little heads up on some of these bolts that the books refuse to tell you about. Uh, let's see, there's three of them that I can give you guys the heads up on. Right there, there's a bolt that goes from under the oil pan. Like, you have to drain the oil. There's no way around it. You have to drain the oil, and there's two bolts under there. There's one right there on the left side. There's your oil filter as soon as it focuses. There we go. Um, that's where your oil filter sits. So it's basically right beside that. And the second one, if it'll focus, is right there. Sorry, I'm jumpy. I horrible angle. Um, yeah, second one's right there. And that is to the right side of the, yeah, right side of the camshaft, crankshaft. Damn it. Um, that one, and then there's one that sits back up in there, and that connects your uh, power steering pump, and your uh, power steering pump will just fall. So be careful when you do that. Um, yeah, I never found out about that one until I was messing with the damn thing and found it just sitting there spinning. I saw a bolt behind it and started running my hands along beside it and found out there was one there holding it on. Um, after you get that off, it is smooth sailing from there. The cover will just pop right off and you can start tearing the timing down which is what I'm doing now I've got the tensioner taken off yeah, it's horrible sorry about this I've um, got the tensioner taken off and the guide for it for the, the side where the tensioner goes get up here there we go <sighs> got the top guide off and the one over here to the right um, not real hard to get those off, uh, two up top or 12 millimeter, uh, just unscrew them, put them back in if you want. Um, these here, they just sit, they just slide right in there and it guides it. And the one with the tensioner goes, uh, there's a, about a quarter inch, I guess, um, Allen wrench you gotta take to it and it holds the bottom bolt on, otherwise the tensioner holds it in place. And those are 10 millimeter. So, after you get those taken off, you can start working on your timing, which is what I'm going to start doing right now because I'm ready to get this damn thing tore apart. Got my radiator and my gaskets in a couple days ago. So, I'm ready to get this thing ripped apart and start driving it again. Um, that's it. Uh, keep you guys posted. I find anything else that'll save your life, time, money, whatever. Don't matter. Alright, have a good one.